Hi, this is Paul Crow, and we're here on Spice Up Your Blog. Now, in this video, I want to look at a um, really quick and easy way you can um, edit your images um, and just make a couple of small changes to images. So, rather than you know opening Photoshop or something like that, you can just go in and make a quick change, like resizing your images and adding a couple of effects. And um, one of the ones that I've used quite a bit and is very popular is a um, it's a Polaroid effect, a kind of a stacked Polaroid effect. And one of the places you'll see this on, the, on our right about us page and I've had a few emails asking me how I did it or how I created the effect just write about us page is basically if, if if you want to write a post about spice up your blog on your blog and spread the word um, it makes sense for me to help so I give a couple of images and so on and some information you can use so here, these are some of the images I have here and you can see here I have a screenshot of spice up your blog it's just on as a plain screenshot with the code you can use and below that I have the Polaroid stacked screenshot and this is the effect I'm talking about here this kind of it's a Polaroid effect with the white edges and then you have that stacked effect of three or four copies of it um, and this is one of the service of, of services offered by drpick.com and that's drpic.com and drpick.com as I said is it's just a really quick simple way of doing a few things to your images so I have it open here let's pop back to the home page of your blog and I have it open over here and this is drpick.com okay we drag this over so as you can see it's just a couple of simple things that you can do and then you have that um, that stacked Polaroid effect which I think is quite cool so let's load a picture up to this so we're just gonna go to load a picture browse we're gonna grab a picture let's grab this Chrome logo and load once that uploads, you have what well, you hear three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen options is all. So there's not you know there's not tons of stuff to confuse you. Um, so you can resize the image, crop the image, rotate the image, add some brightness and stuff. If you're actually uploading a picture, a camera taking picture, you can kind of sharpen it and so on. And you can add some text to your picture. Um, and then you have a couple of um, kind of effects, including the Polaroid effect, which is here. So I click the Polaroid effect. You can see here with three options: tilt to the left stack effect and tilt to the right so the stack effect is the one that I've used quite a lot the background color this would be if your background your color of your blog maybe with black you could put the background background color as black um, but let's apply it as it is to get the stacked effect it takes a couple of seconds and there you go so there we have the stacked effect added to that image and if I wanted to grab that let's just quickly look at one or two of the other options first let's go, by clicking this little arrow here we undo the change we made Let's get a Polaroid effect and just show you when you tilt the image. Let's tilt it to the right and apply. And there you go. It's just being tilted to the right with a kind of a shadow effect. We'll undo that. And we can add an oil paint effect, which will probably work better on actual pictures, but it doesn't look too bad there either. So as you can see, just really quick, simple ways you can change an image to make it look a little bit better. Um, so let's go to our, our Polaroid effect one more time. And once you add your effect or crop your image or change your image or resize your image, um, you can then just save it to your computer and upload it quickly to your blog. So this is taking a little bit extra time. There we go. So that's done. With that stack effect done, you'll be just coming down, save to disk. Once you click save to disk, you come down here, click OK, and you save your image. And now you can go and upload it to your blog and use that image. So that's it, really. Dr. Pick, D-R-P-I-C dot com. If you're watching this on YouTube, I'll have a link back to this video in a post with more information on Spice Up Your Blog about Dr. Pick and how to use it. And if you have any questions, just drop them in the comments. Let's drag this back. There we go. That's it. Thanks for watching the video.